Today, we are going to be making the Batarang from the new The Batman. So, we're just going to be making it here at home. Um, and we are going to harden it. So, we're going to use 1095 still. And we'll get to it. Okay, first off. We're just going to throw a bunch of magnets down on the paper. We printed it out so that it would be uh, accurate and proportionate to the actual movie and the new battering, but we're going to trace it out here in a second. We've drawn it out on the steel. Uh, we're in the process of moving though, so uh, stuff everywhere. We're going back to the basics. Angle, grind, angle grinder, safety glasses, clamp to the table. But we got it drawn out, so now we're gonna cut it with the angle grinder. Uh, this is something almost anybody can do. This is how I started making knives with stuff Simple like this, so here we go. It's a lot harder to get into all those areas than I th thought. So we're gonna have to do a lot of file work, but there we go, kind of. Um, we got all these burrs and stuff on the edges, so we're just gonna start filing everything off. So, I forgot how long it takes to uh, file stuff, and with all these different little curves, um, took a little bit. Couldn't get the angle grinder in everywhere that I wanted, but we're pretty close there. So now, we're going to take a flap disc on the angle grinder and put our bevels in just on, just on the top part here. So that's all we really need. And then it'll be able to to stick into things. Then we'll heat treat it. We have the edge there. It's not quite sharp yet, but that's okay because we're going to heat treat it. And then we're just going to go over it with a wet sandstone to put an edge. So, we're going to heat treat it now. Um, we've got something to put our oil in. Some canola oil. Our battering. And a torch. So, oh, and some pliers to hold your battering or your knife, whatever you're making. So, uh, we're going to fill this up with some oil, and that way we can heat treat it.
Oh. So we're good because the heat only went here. So when we heat treat this side, it won't affect it. But now we're going to heat treat the other side. Now both edges are hard. What's nice about this is we don't even have to paint it. The blade is black. So it fits in perfectly. We're not looking for a razor sharp edge, but we do want it sharpened and hard. So now we're going to go test it and throw it. Sweet, we got it to stick. And there it is. In all of its Batman glory.